Jeez, man, I thought Black Friday was bad, but it turns out the whole damn holiday, the whole month is bad. Because of bad customers, rude customers. People, like, it's the year 2016, guys. 2016, I've been on this earth for 26 years. It is the year of anything being at the touch of your fingertip. I work in retail. You guys know this. And people need to understand that holidays, retail gets busy. Walmart, Target, Best Buy, Burlington Coat Factory, you name it, there's a line. For the last month now, or maybe not a month, last maybe two weeks, I've had rude customers come up to me and complain about the lines. And it's getting down to the point to where I'm about to take off that, how are you, okay, you know what, bitch? Like, just take off the friendly customer service mask and be real. Say, look, it's the holidays. You're going to be waiting in line for 45 minutes. All right? Relax. And, and why do people still feel like they have to come up with excuses? Like, a lot of, like, I'm the supervisor up front, okay? We open up at 9 a.m. Between 9 a.m. and 10.30, maybe 5 to 10 people walk around the store. Come 10.30 to noon, line is packed. Because everyone, you know, getting off work or dropping their kids off or whatever. And they just bitch and whine about the lines. In the morning time, when we open, any retail person can tell you this. There's not going to be a lot of cashiers. There's not going to be a lot of people on the floor to help you out because da -da 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 -da, we just opened. So when the line is long, the excuses and bullshit that customers say to me. I've had a customer complain to me saying, hey, can we move this line along? I need to go to a funeral. Motherfucker, why are you shopping for clothes when you got a funeral to go to? Funerals are planned. You should have gotten your shit like two days after whoever you're going to see died. I had one woman complain about the line saying, I stood in line for about 45 minutes and I have a bowel movement issue. If you have problems and you shit your pants or you feel like you're about to shit your pants consecutively, you need to shop online. Take your laptop, sit on the toilet, and go on Amazon. If it's that bad. Just like what? What's today? Last week, I had a woman come up to me while waiting in line saying, my husband's in the car sick and I'm sitting here waiting in line for y'all. You need to have more cashiers. Your husband is sick in the car, why is he not in the hospital? Why is he not at home? It's 67 degrees in Vegas in the morning. Why is your husband sitting in the car freezing to death? Bring his ass in here, we got benches he can sit on in a nice warm area. Soon as she got in line, this was her. I want to return this. I have this bag of returns, and I also have this I need to return. But it's all different transactions. So you basically just made a lie to me. And I fucking looked at her. And I gave her a fucking look. I should have threw shade at her and saying, oh, tell your husband I said feel better when she fucking left out. I should have said that. I'm just sick and tired of rude customers, okay? People have to understand that me, and not just me, plenty of people that work in retail or fast food service, we're taking, this is the type time of year where we want to spend time with our families, but instead, we want to make money so we can get gifts and get Christmas dinner started and all the other shit. So we come to work to make you have an easier experience and get all the stuff you need to get out of the way. Food, toys, clothes, Christmas present, all that other shit. So you whine and complain. I stood in line because we had a discount going on. You know what I did when I was waiting in line? I got my damn phone out and ordered some shit off Amazon to get some cousins I have or whatever their Christmas gifts. I said, well, fuck, I'm in line. Okay, let me just go ahead and shop while I'm waiting in line to get this stuff. 
There's no excuse now. It's 2016. Customers, stop being rude. Stop with the foolishness. I'm taking precious time I have to make sure you can get your shit together. Please be grateful, or at least be patient. I even come up to customers every now and then say, thank you so much for your patience. We really appreciate your value time. I don't say that just to say that. I say that because I'm like, yeah, because I don't like waiting in line. People have to realize is that I'm a, like, you know, people who work at retail are people too. They pick up their mail. They wipe their ass. They don't like waiting in line either. But it's like, what can you do? What can you do? So let's just be grateful this holiday season. Because I really don't want to have to take off that mask that I have to put on when I go to work every day. And be real with people. Let's have a happy holiday. No more complaining.